Happy Friday, my friends. How is everybody doing today? TGIF. Indeed, Balinor. How you doing, by the way? Hope you're feeling well. What's up, Dr. D? Appreciate that, my friend. Four month hype. Yes, sir. Appreciate that. Cheers. Cheers, everybody, to Dr. D. Yeah, Nidalicious, so I was trying to get a, uh, the point across that there are no guarantees for today. You know what I'm trying to say? You feel me, dog? Oh my gosh. We got we got Curry up in here too? <laughs> Woohoo! Thank you so much, Curry. Cheers. How you doing? How you doing? Ooh, that tasted good. I had to get a second sip. Sometimes you guys, I mean, it's just water, but you ever take a drink of water and you're like, ooh, water's delicious. I do that every now and then. Um, how you all doing though? Balinor, hope you're feeling alright, my friend. Um, recovering well. So, we <laughs> got a hundred bits from Dr. D as well. Jeez. Cheers, my friend. Thank you so much. I did not deserve that. I've done nothing to deserve that, but I, I seriously appreciate the hundred gold coins. My goodness. Uh, happy Friday to you, potatoes. Happy Friday. Woo, Curry, welcome in, Cypher. The way the looter, mouse clicks, and a computer. Of course, of course. When word counts matters, and you are, or when word count matters, uh, and you are still missing a couple to meet it, hence the title of the stream. <laughs> uh, maybe, maybe, maybe I should try to make the longest stream title I can. Um, nah, it's just, it's, I just, I had to make sure there were no guarantees. No. We never black out. Hey, what's going on, Nonder? Good morning, good morning, and Covert Cell. It is indeed finally Friday. My morning's going okay so far. I actually just put in a brand new set of contacts. Um, and I'm gonna, be, uh, this is weird. Maybe I should post a picture of it in the Discord. Um, I've never seen this before, but I get my contacts from a company online, and they have never done this before. Um, it took me, it took me forever to even get the contacts. That was a whole other ordeal. Um, and then when I take the right, like one of my right eye boxes, I take it out and I'm like, I open it up and I'm like, this is kind of weird looking. And I compare it to the ones that I just put in my left eye and they're different. Like it, it's, it's, it was in the same box, sort of. Um, but the label on the actual like plastic little container that has the contact lens in it looked different. And I was like, what is this? So I flip it over and I'm reading the back and basically it looks like just a generic version. It came from the same, the same company. Uh, just, it didn't have the like model name on it, whatever you want to call it. Um, so I look, I think it's just a generic version of my contact lenses. Uh, and so I look at the box and I, I'm like, this is a freaking sticker on the front of the box. So I start peeling it off and there's nothing underneath the sticker. So I think I got super generic contacts for my right eye, at least in one box. The other box is normal, because um, I got four total boxes, two per eye. Like, what the heck is this? I, I've never seen this before, so I might reach out to him today and be like, what's going on? Um, and I don't know if it's just a coincidence or what, but my right eye is the one that's sort of not adjusting as well right now. So, I don't know, very weird. Anyway, um, that's how my that's how my morning's going thus far, Covert. But. And hello to all the peeps. So far, so good not having fun. Not fun having all this packing in the nose, but I'm managing... Oh, shoot. I bet that's... Yeah. I bet that is not very fun. But hopefully it's... um, Hopefully it'll continue to improve, Balinor. What's going on, Coleman? Good morning, good morning. Woke up surprisingly early, so made a fancy co... Ooh, what's a fancy coffee, potatoes? What, what constitutes a fancy coffee? Of course, Balinor. Of course, you got it. We want to see a we want to see a heal up nice and strong, and hope that uh, everything that you know the the surgery was supposed to fix does fix that. I know uh, sense of smell was one of the things you had mentioned, so hopefully that uh, works out. Are you streaming today? Maybe, possibly, potentially. Isn't it delicious. No, no guarantees. Once told my wife that she never. <laughs> well, then. Uh... Then, then you deserve this. Five bits. Appreciate that, Nidalicious. Five gold coins. Cheers. <clears throat> What's going on, Dr. Trip Chance and Majestic Marlow? Welcome in. You lie, my friend? Wait, what did I... Who lied? Once told my wife that she never misses me. Upon hearing that, she threw a plate at me. I was right. She never missed me. 
Uh, that's funny. Finally Friday, thank goodness. Has it been a rough week, Marla? I hopefully hopefully the weekend gets better. Got a generic, uh, and they charge you the same. Yeah, they they charge me they charge me exactly the same. Now, like I said, I think they are pretty much the exact same thing, but I can't imagine it costs them the same. You know what I mean? Um, yeah. <laughs> one normal eye, one Borg implant. I wish, I wish. Unfortunately, not that fancy. <laughs> the iPhone from Futurama. <laughs> Uh, does the weird contact lens give you any special superpower? Yeah, uh, the power of not crystal clear vision. So, kind of lame. A little on the lame side. But, hey, what's going on, Chaotic? Latte, okay. I usually have black coffee. That's all I've got today is some black coffee in my black Emo's Not Dead mug, which I should probably take a sip of. Ah, that's good. I actually made a latte, well, sort of. I sort of made a latte, what, last weekend? I kind of failed at it, so probably not going to do that one again exactly the same. Uh, so this is where I went wrong. I put, I made my coffee. Um, I put the milk in it and a little bit of sugar, and that was pretty good. But then I thought, oh, maybe I should try to make it a little bit more strong, <clears throat> stronger of a coffee. And so I put some instant espresso in it. That ruined it. That just totally ruined it. So not doing that again, but... Fancy coffee is the coffee you make yourself, not because you need to be caffeinated, but just to enjoy it. Yeah, true. True. My Michelle, welcome in. Borg. Far too long having that message queued up. <laughs> Curry's fave race is Borg. Very nice. Resistance is futile. My brain is dis disconnected from my head today. I'm not sure how long I have been awake. Everything is in slow motion around me. Oh, I've had days like that. It is really weird. Like, you actually do feel like you're in slow motion. Speaking emo, are there any more recent bands you listen to that scratch that emo itch? Ooh, any recent bands? Um, that's a good question. I I do have some. Um, I don't think I don't know if it's truly an emo itch, but but they kind of my taste has evolved, not evolved, but expanded. I should say because I still like emo. Let's be honest. Um, it's not evolved. It's not changed. It's just expanded. So there are some, there are some music, there's some music that I've listened to somewhat recently um, that I I like a lot, but uh, but I don't know that it's truly an emo itch at that point. So it's just a dream. I've heard of some people drink coffee for joy, but I haven't had it yet and haven't seen those people. Uh, well, I mean, I don't know. I do know people that claim that they're uh, they're like oh, I'm not myself until I've had coffee, and I'm like, really? You're not yourself? So. The Mystique, uh, spray you in the face, South Park reference. <laughs> oh, gosh. Uh, uh, I've expanded a lot, too. That's cool. For sure. For sure. I'll, um, if I can, uh, if I can get a good way of sharing some of the, um, if I can get a good way of sharing some of the music I have listened to at least somewhat recently, uh, in, in Discord, I will. I, I mainly listen to Amazon Music, so I might try to see if I can find like a couple of my favorite songs and just leak link them in a uh, YouTube or something. So <laughs> I'm not myself yet. I need coffee to complete my smoking. <laughs> sure thing, Nander. Yeah. Uh, not beating the bot at any speed today. We got 45 gold coins from Marla as well. Appreciate that, majestic Marla. Cheers. Cheers. Um, if you're not yourself without coffee, it basically means you're a butthole without a central stimulant drug. Yeah, I, I don't know. I've always kind of laughed at that a little bit, but true fact smokers favorite non-alcoholic drink is coffee. I believe that. I believe that. Hearts, hearts. I, uh, I don't know that I can do a good, I mean, hearts aren't that hard to do, but I one time went to a concert, um, and there was no joke. This, this, uh, this girl was standing in front of me. And you could tell she was trying. She was trying to make a heart. Um, and it seriously was this. It was it was more of a spade than a heart. And I'm like, eh, she's kind of got her she's got her suits mixed up. But this is seriously what unless she was trying to unless a spade means something. And I don't know. Um, that's why I've always sort of been like, well, crap, maybe. I mean, I don't really do hearts a lot, so maybe I'm not very good at them. But uh, but yeah, she legit was doing more of a spade like it was it wasn't even close to a heart. So. Uh, I've been a little bit worried ever since. That was about like, that was about like uh, ten years ago. Still worried. <laughs> so, <laughs> oh my, spitting facts. 
Uh, I smoked for 13 years before I quit, and I am a tea drinker. Is that right, uh, Chaotic? I didn't know that. Well, I'm glad you quit. I'm glad you quit. There's a subreddit called r slash uh, took too much. Sounds like Spades Lady might be a candidate. Took too much? <laughs> oh, gosh. I don't know. I really don't know what it was. Um, I don't I, I don't think it was that type of concert. It was it was indoor. Um, it was indoors on a dry campus, uh, like in in our uh, what do you want to call it? Like in our arena. Um, it was a small college, too. Uh, I'll just I'll just put it this way. Like, I did not smell any anything uh, illegal going on there. Um, so I don't I, I mean, unless she just had a lot to pregame beforehand. I I don't think so. But maybe I don't know. Maybe she's very good at, uh, at hiding things. But my ex is a smoker gag and his fave is black coffee. I, I, I feel like it's maybe it's a flavor thing because, you know, like the smoking um, sort of takes that away from you. Because I know tons of smokers, or at least people that used to smoke, and they always had to load up their food with salt. It was it was super like super salty foods, super weird. Um, but yeah, August tenth. Okay, so about 10, 11 years ago now. Congrats, chaotic. Yeah, that's good because uh, it's just. I know it's tough. It's tough. So you got heart spades. Can anyone do a club when showing love or something? <laughs> Give it a shot. Uh, you can do a diamond. Probably not that much different from a spade. Uh, there's, it's kind of like my diamond, a little bit uh, asymmetrical. But uh, if somebody else wants to take over the club, I'm, you know, the clubs. <laughs> 2010 feels like forever ago, doesn't it? At the park grave, uh, there was this Viking-looking dude, hefty with a big beard. He was not on the same plan as the rest of us, but he was mostly on P. <laughs> uh, when you said not on the same plan, I'm thinking, was this dude like super just? said he was a viking looking dude was he just like ripped or something and then i understood not on the same planet not in the same universe 11 years next month yeah that's awesome no smoker but i've always had black coffee yeah i'm not i'm i don't i haven't always had black coffee but uh over the last couple years i've been black coffee pretty much lack of flavor maybe possibly potentially perhaps <laughs> i also love salt so i do too i do too but i don't load it up like i'm serious I went to, it, it was a breakfast actually, and they got black coffee um, and the eggs. And I'm not kidding you. They, they took the salt and just went all over everything. And I'm like, holy freaking crap. Like, just might as well just live in a salt mine at that point. I read it in a scientific textbook. It got a whole scientific research about pancreatic cancer results. Dom founded because they were investigating the association about coffee and pancreatic cancer, but didn't know that coffee is smokers' favorite drink, so their research went unacceptable. Really? Are you sure I'm not your ex? <laughs> he looked like he would deadlift about 300 pounds, but far from ripped. Okay. Frame drop on Luth's side or mine? Um, I don't have any drop frames currently. Confounded. Yeah, I gotcha. I gotcha. Is your name Brendan? <laughs> Yes? No. Wouldn't that be something? Oh, my friends. I'm going to go ahead and launch this game. Loving the conversation we're having. Um, I have no idea how we're going to... How close we're going to be to Resident Evil Village's end. I know when we had raided uh, last weekend, uh, our resident Resident Evil expert... Uh, AK Curry Cosmos had uh, had said that I, I think she had estimated about two more playthroughs or two more sessions. So I guess it's just gonna we're just gonna see how close we can get. So <laughs> it's Ali. Okay, <laughs> that would have been fascinating to see. That would have been. Could you imagine how ridiculously small this planet would seem if that were the case? But protuberance, welcome back in. How you doing? Hello to you. Good, you're better than Brendan already. <laughs> Speaking of which, okay. Resident Evil CG anime is on Netflix now. Is it really? Is that like a super recent thing? What's going on, Fresh? How you doing? But I have the potential to be your ex. <laughs> oh gosh, we're gonna we're not gonna start hitting on people in chat, are we? What's going on, true Kelt? Hello there. <laughs> General Kenobi. 
got a weird window sound from trying to do that. How you doing though, True Celt? And fresh, freshly bathed. We're gonna go with fresh, unless I hear otherwise. Whoa, hang on a second, I have to show you this. This is, um, this has changed a bit. I don't know if this is, was there an update or is this just due to the part of the game I'm in? <laughs> Chat romance. <laughs> Uh, this is a different menu. Anybody know? Is this is this just relative to my position in the game, or is this is this an update? <laughs> General Kenobi. Super recent launched on the. Okay, nice, very nice. I feel like there's some good stuff coming to Netflix this month. I I occasionally will look it over, and I looked at this month and I was kind of like, not bad. I'm kind of impressed. So. <clears throat> Uh, let's see. So my sleep goes even worse over the... Wait, hang on a second. Oh, if my sleep goes even worse over the weekend, you all know why, right? Just stood up to feed the cats and walking is a challenge. Oh, be careful, Chaotic. I am good. Hello, friends. Glad to hear you're doing well, Kelt. In what way is it different? Uh, there was no fire before. It was... And it was lighter. Um, the, the background is darker and there was no fire, uh, before. No pressure, but every community needs a good love story. It's a rite of passage. <laughs> Oh man, I uh, I will try to provide. I don't really know how I'm gonna do that. All right, um, maybe we'll have a matchmaker Monday someday. How's that? How's that sound, Nander? So we get we need to get all the single ladies, and single single fellas, and everybody in between. Um, and we're just gonna we're just gonna have like a matchmaker just day on. How's that? Would that be Would that be good? I don't know. <laughs> it's just I don't know if that's gonna work out. Um, Hyper Splinter Cell Anime 2. Also, I'm caught up on Loki via Disney+. Plus. Yeah, I've heard... I mean, everybody keeps talking about Loki being good, and I'm sitting here like, man, I haven't even watched any of it yet. It sucks. Currently watching Attack on Titan. How's that going, Dr. D? So, it's gonna be wild. Did you beat Heisenberg? It look could look like the village after Heisenberg's fight. Uh, I have not... I have not fought Heisenberg yet. I just actually made him upset, as far as I know. So... <clears throat> Does in between count uh, as wait? In between counts in a relationship. I would love to have an internet boyfriend, like work husband. Oh, I got gotcha. you. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I guess that's up to the both of you, potatoes. It's a visual rep representation of how well the game thinks your playthrough is. Yeah, that seems about right. <laughs> that seems about right. Oh, covert. I need. I really need like a an applause button. I really need an applause button. Curry Matchmaker Cosmos at your service. <laughs> Me and you DJ are gonna have our own little POY corner. <laughs> poi corner? What is that? Paul oh poly corner. Okay. I was like, I was like, what's a poi corner? I don't know what this is. Just let it happen naturally. Happy I found this stream. We're happy you're here too, Marla. Appreciate that. My L button is acting up. Is it actually? I've never had a key go bad on me, thankfully. Matchmaker sounds cool. We can all get the single lady and well me. <laughs> Anyone I've seen in your chat was married. Oh. Agreed with Curry. Agreed, Marla. Uh, if you're new who likes documentaries, Disney Plus has a fantastic one about Wolfgang Puck. I've been watching lots of streaming content this weekend. Wolfgang Puck, huh? Really? After season two, I have more questions than I have answers, and it's effing brutal. Oh, gosh. Takes a bow, of course, Covert. Take a bow. I have a Twitch boyfriend. Is that good? <laughs> hey, what's going on, Tice? Nidalicious, who's your Twitch boyfriend? Can we know? How you doing, though, Tice? Happy Friday, my friend. I started watching Resident Evil Infinite Darkness. Oh, okay. And how is it thus far, Kelt? Yes, yes, and yes. I've had to, uh, I've had keys go off before on my laptops just in this past decade. I've never had one go bad, thankfully. Um, Although I was considering, although I don't know if Chaotic is here, so hopefully she can't hear this. I've been considering maybe getting a different keyboard. Um, But, um, you know... She really loves my blue switches, so I just don't want her to. I don't want her to uh, be disappointed. You know, she's like in love with my blue switches. So, yeah. Uh, it's not registering with the presses, all presses, and it's concerning me. Though should still be under warranty. That's good at least. Two episodes in, and I like it. Very nice. 
It's Koya Bridges. I've claimed him as mine. Okay. Uh, I feel feel like that name's familiar. Maybe did you like host him or something or raid? I'm glad. Yeah, for sure. I'm pretty good considering the chaos the Netherlands is in right now. How are you? What? Wait, hang on. What's going on in the Netherlands? Am I behind on some important news? Gamer keyboard. Get some RGB. It actually is already RGB. Um, I'll see if I can show you here. Oop. Oop. Oh, no, it's trapped. I can't do it. I can't do it, but um, it is RGB. It's just... Um, I don't know. I <laughs> The thing is, I really like blue switches when I'm playing by myself, but streaming, I'm not a huge fan. I'm just going to be honest, all right? Chaota can sit over there and do her happy dance. She, she pretends not to be here. Yeah, I can do a pick on Discord. Claimed noise. Watch this coily from the corner of my eye. <laughs> yeah, here, I'll post a picture on Discord for you right now. I'll do it. Uh, I like it. It's a it's an Aki. Uh, well, here, let me just... Uh, oh, my mic's in the way. Okay, hang on a second. Move this out of the way. Okay. All right. There you go. Uh, but even on your own, they're so obnoxious. I just... I don't know. They have such a satisfying sound i don't know what it is i just i don't know how to put it but it's just so satisfying and i, I don't it's just a little bit too loud for stream that's all and it's impossible to get it removed from the audio um it's actually impossible even if i put the mic like right up here which i don't i don't know if i would ever want to be like this kind of person uh if people do it it's fine but the thing is is like i I don't know. I prefer the I prefer the look of the not having the mic in my face, but <sighs> I just got a racist R rated joke about the Netherlands. Oh, all right. Well don't share that. Our COVID infections are ten times the amount they were last week. Seems we're going into lockdown again. Are you serious? I'd heard about uh Japan because of the upcoming Olympic Games, but I didn't know that uh, the Netherlands was in such bad shape. Uh, well, stay safe out there, Tice. What kind of mic is that? Uh, it's a Rode Pod mic. This is a Rode Pod mic. You were holding up your phone, and I thought it was your keyboard. I was super confused. That's <laughs> really that would be pretty uh, pretty impressive, right? I'll check out this uh, very mobile keyboard right here. All right, I was trying to post it, and I got distracted. So let me uh, let me add this. Uh, I am gonna do what N uh, Nitalicious had suggested. I think it was Nitalicious. Um, we're going to have like an as scene on stream chat. That way people that um, are not in the stream aren't super confused by our random pictures. This is kind of funny. I put keyboard pick as requested. It feels like I should be po posting this on my OnlyFans. There you go. Keyboard pick as requested. There you go. Uh, it's an Aki... Um, Something rather, I don't remember exactly what. I like it. Uh, like I said, it's been it's been really good. It's got a nice sturdy build to it. It's super heavy. Um, it just feels good under my fingertips. That's all. But satisfying sounds. Talking about ASMR, kind of getting fully back tomorrow. Congrats on that bathed, fresh. I kept calling you bathed, and then uh, Mrs. Magoose is like, eh. <laughs> Obviously deafened you from their loud noises. I guess so. <laughs> Sounds better the other way. Yeah, it's a Rode Pod, uh, Rode Pod mic. So they have like a Rode, uh, there's like a Rode Podcaster or something like that, or Rodecaster, Procaster, I don't know, just a bunch of funny names. So it is mechanical, Balinor, yeah. He's repeated that he's my Twitch boyfriend, so the claim has been confirmed and accepted. Very nice. Give me that follow. No, I'm not doing this. Cheers. Welcome in. Welcome in. You're in the hunt for a mic? Well, I do have a Blue Yeti, if you're interested at all. Blue Yeti Blackout, if you're interested. Uh, I don't know how much it would cost me to ship it up to Canada, but um, but it could potentially be an option if you're interested. So. Uh, it's because the clubs went open again and everyone went crazy uh, with going out. Really? So it just like kind of came out of 
thin air basically everybody's like oh let's go out let's just let's just all go out together and not get vaccinated and stuff yeah a pretty lit keyboard thank you appreciate that uh, of course delta mutation is causing new problems globally maybe the netherlands has got that problem i'm not interested in human medicine so i haven't studied that one sorry road trip could uh, that'd be an interesting road trip right for a mic delivery were you saying I go up to Canada or Curry comes down to the United States? Which one is it? Delta's not that bad here. A couple of hundred cases, I believe, but it stays around that number. I prefer mechanical keyboards for the satisfying click. Me too, yeah. I actually, this was my first mechanical keyboard. And uh, I think it was Kirk that was like, once you go clicky-clack, you never go back. And I'm like, you're right. Because I'm, I'm never getting a regular keyboard again. At least not to game on. So, love the keyboard. Appreciate that. Put the Yeti mic into the guild ship ship around program. That's true. We could. This thing's way a ton. You would have to remortgage to post it. The the Yeti? Or you mean the uh no no the pod mic weighs a lot. The Yeti's pretty light, actually. But uh for me, the reason I got rid of the Yeti, so it's a condenser mic, so it's a little bit more um it picks up a little bit more of everything. Um uh, and it's a little bit less targeted than the pod mic. Also, it's just huge. Um, and where I put it, like I sometimes need to look down at my keyboard and I can't see my keyboard. So that's why I got rid of it. Um, it works great. The audio was was pretty nice. Um, but um, but I just want to try something different. So. So, yeah, that's where uh, that's uh, that's my life story. So meet halfway. We could, I guess. Yeah. Glad to hear that. Uh, young people are being vaccinated now, so it means half the people going out haven't gotten the chance to get a vaccine. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. And that's that honestly, that happened here too, uh, Tice. So, hey, what's going on, Professor? And no, I'm not doing this. Welcome in. You just make a bunch of ambient noise. It's a great mic minus that. Yeah. If you can, if you can get your filters and everything set up and your room is super quiet, you're pretty good. Um, but even this one, like, Really, I shouldn't be using it the way that I am. Um, it's not meant to be this far away from my face, although it's not that far, but uh, it's it really is kind of meant to be right up in your face. <laughs> oh, my gosh. We got a mod for a day. Oh, goodness. Goodness, goodness. Um, so uh, not doing this. I am. I'll show you how far I am. Let me go ahead and load this up, and then we got to give Nidalicious mod powers for the day. Uh, let me do that real fast. Oh, wait, hang on a second. It's this one. All right, there you go, Nidalicious. Say something. See if we got a sword next to your name. Only one other time has this been uh, redeemed, and that was for uh, Curry. I told you to change it to VIP for a month. Yeah, I know. I know. But what does VIP do other than just give you a badge? If we all get banned now, we will know why. It'll be all right. I can undo all the damage, everybody. I think, unless he bans me, then then there's nothing I can do. <clears throat> uh, is there? Oh, do you share the Discord? Thank that. Thank you, chaotic. Uh, I find that mics don't pick up the resonance in my voice very well, so I know I sound softer and higher pitch uh, than what a mic picks up. Oh, well then, yeah, you'd want a condenser mic. You'd absolutely want a condenser mic then. Unlike my state, where people turn on the vaccine or mine, yeah. Got to run a sec. Just want to say hi and good morning. I appreciate that, Professor. Hope you have an awesome day. My mom just booked her first vaccine. I'm not crying. You are? Oh, I, could you get my dad on it now, potatoes? My dad's sort of like, he's like, well, I don't really go and do anything anyway. I'm like, yeah, you need to get it, Dad. And he doesn't. To be fair, he's not out there, like, going places and doing stuff with random people. But it's just like, you know, got a Yeti na Nano. Okay, how is it, Dr. D? Do I get banned now? We will know why. I'm almost there. Are you really, Kelt? Great the system became mod for attorney. Yeah, sort of. Ban loots. Mod for day. You get a ban. You get a ban. You get a ban. Actually thought he'd refund it and fix the redeem. <laughs> mod is too much control, though. I mean, it's really just, uh, I don't know. I mean, I guess the wrong person could get it. They'd have to spend a lot of time in chat to be able to get that, though. You know what I mean? Hostile takeover. Uh, nowhere near the end because I'm scared of the doll. Oh, I gotcha. Not doing this. That that part was actually... That might have actually been my favorite part of the game. Uh, not because of the fact that it was a doll, but because of the puzzles involved in that. Lutz, I'm going to have to see your feet. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, you want to see my feet? All right, here we go. All right, this one's for you, Balinor. Uh, here we go. Here we go. 
Socks and sandals, let's go because it's Friday. Socks and sandals on Fridays, everybody. There you go. There's my feet. <laughs> no, let's just ban Balinor. <laughs> let's go. Socks and sandals Friday, everybody. Banned and then unbanned Balinor. Oh, gosh. <laughs> oh, gosh. I didn't even get to see Balinor's message. <laughs> Dolls and horror games are terrifying, so I get you. Yeah, they are pretty terrifying. El Elgato Wave 3 is a really cool mic, Professor. Glad you've been enjoying it. 47,000 points for True Kelt. My goodness. Parents uh, finally got the vac, so this needed for travel. Okay. Yeah, well, that's good. That's good, though. I mean, honestly, if it if it takes just hanging the Kara out in front of their face, I think it's a good thing, you know? So uh, I'm barefooted in bed, so I'm safe from the band hammer. <laughs> We wear socks and sandals on Friday. Yes, we do. Yes, we do. Not only Friday, but especially on Friday. <clears throat> Ask me wants to see grandkids that will do it. Wait, grandkids that will do. Oh, oh, my dad. Yeah. Unfortunately, though, my sister's not going to do that. I don't have any children. So, yeah, pretty good. I like it. That's good. Uh, and I bet it's good. Just, I mean, for that smaller form factor, it'd be worth it. So. Parents are in Hong Kong. They have Pfizer, but it's distributed by the Chinese pharma, and they were worried it's not widely approved. Oh, yeah, that would be afraid. That would be pretty scary. Can't get vaccinated. My heart has forever changed since I was really sick from COVID in November. The doctors don't recommend me risking to get the vaccine. That's okay, Marla. I, I don't blame anybody who has been told not to get a vaccine. I don't, I'm not blaming anybody for not getting the vaccine, you know. Um, I do just, there are some people, um, like my brother-in-law, he's got no real reason not to get it. He's just like, no, I'm not going to get it. <laughs> It's like, dude, you have your, he's a teacher. So he's around children. Um, and he has two children himself, you know? Um, and it's just like, neither him nor his wife is going to get it. It's like, come on, please help us out here. You know, um, his, his dad has, uh, like, like his dad is high risk, but his dad does have like, so my father-in-law does have the, the vaccine. So like he should in theory be protected, but it's just one of those things where like, the more people that have it, you know, the closer we can get to herd immunity in family groups, the better off we're going to be. Because we're never getting to herd immunity uh, as a country here in the United States. But uh, cheers to Cypher. Appreciate that. <clears throat> um, that's why it's important for others to do it around you. Exactly. Exactly what True Kelt said. But the Red That Redeem is cheer up. And I thought you had a new one to remind everyone to cheer up. That's what the doctors have said. You should listen to them. It's up to those who can get it to get it. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. We got the new uh, Lutz Rip emote. So <clears throat> I'll blame anyone that won't take the Viking vaccine due to microchips, magnetic powers, or that nanoprotein thing that was a thing for two days ago. Uh, one Nikito imitator. Appreciate that follow. Cheers. Wherever there's Resident Evil, I'll be there. What's up, guys? Hashtag Brazil. Welcome in. Welcome from Brazil. Uh, chat is no longer showing up for me. Are you serious? Uh, could you do like an F5, Balinor? I completely agree. I would totally get vaccinated if I were allowed. I was barred from doing the clinical trial for Canadian variant of the vaccine, though that might be due to the participant being a participant in my allergy clinic rather than the meds I'm on. Gotcha. Accurate image of me right now. <laughs> I'm glad. I'm glad you all are enjoying the loot's rip. Uh, I think you'll get some use out of it. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and no. Wait, hang on. Yeah, let's continue this. I'm gonna eat a pop tart. Ooh, what flavor? What flavor we got here? Waiting for that next stage of approvals on vaccines. The younger crowd needs it too. Yeah, true. They do. I did unban you immediately. <laughs> there we go. Had to completely close out and reopen. Oh dang. Okay, so it's probably because of Nidalicious. What a turd. Banning perfectly good, healthy people here. Balinor is perfectly healthy now. I'm just messing. Health has nothing to do with it. Everybody's welcome here, but. <laughs> cookie dough. Oh, cookie dough Pop-Tarts. I haven't had one of those in a long time, but look, I warned both of you ages ago. <laughs> you did. You did. Yeah, we'll have to figure something else out. Um, what would be a good, other than just VIP for a day, since that's chaotic suggestion, do we have any other suggestions on what would be a good, oh, this is, okay, right, 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 okay, I ran back in from Heisenberg's factory over to the Duke to do some sales and whatnot, and I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure I got 
most things sold up and everything, right? Yeah. Did I just get to the factory? Not just, but welcome in, Ali Fox. Um, not just got to the factory, but but pretty recently. Pretty recently. I what I've done so far is I fought a few things in here. Uh, I did a few of the molds. Um, not not like, well, I should clarify on that. I made a few. Uh, I did a little bit of smelting in the factory, and that's pretty much all I've done so far. Uh, and then I ran back out and I I saved at the Duke. So, um, I don't know how much more I have of the factory. Immediate abuse of power, right? I'll ban Delicious tomorrow. <laughs> Cookie dough pop tarts, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, they are uh, only in like the smaller boxes. Uh, not doing this. Where are you from? Are you from the U.S. as well? Because we, I feel like we have more pop tart flavors than anybody. I, I could be wrong on that, but but yeah. Tomorrow's Saturday. I mean, you still could. You can ban anybody at any time as a mod, but. Let's go. I'm looking forward to seeing you do this next part. Uh-oh. You should be VIP for a month if you spend 50k. Okay, so a lot of people think VIP for a month. Not a day. Yeah, true. Okay. Bye. Why do you Brazilians on Twitch find it impossible not to tell everyone from Brazil? P.S. Please feel free to, t to tell me to mind my own business. Say that every 50,000 redeem means Lutz has a five kilometer run and streams it from his phone. Oh my gosh. Would you actually enjoy that? I think that would be pretty boring. Uh, the thing is, I'm not like, I don't run distance anymore, but I'm not, I'm not so out of shape that a 5k would be like super difficult. So you wouldn't get to see me like puke or anything exciting. I would just basically go on a long run and be uncomfortable. <laughs> and of course the, uh, uh, the camera would be super shaky. <laughs> Oh, right. Okay, so I got a new pistol and a new um, shotgun. Forgot about that. So many mods in chat. Yeah. One too many, right, Tice? One too many. Oh, you again? oh my gosh. Oh, my sweet lord. I didn't even get a chance to catch my breath. You can get through that, right? There's no way you can't. Really? Homie can't get through this door. He's got a whole freaking engine on his face and he can't get through this door. Okay. <laughs> like mines. My puppies might say hello here. I came in like a wrecking ball. You guys, uh, there's like a, there's a metal version of that song. It's pretty good, actually, but becomes mod pans themselves. <laughs> I never said VIP for a day. Wait, did I just read something wrong? I know. I, I saw you said a month. You might have said VIP for a day, like way back when, but no, I knew you said via, uh, VIP for a month. Flossing the dance on stream. Oh, gosh. Considered that as well, banning myself. Do you get in a workout or run each morning before stream? You're way more awake and alert than me. Uh, no, I don't do it in the mornings. I used to actually lift in the mornings, but I do not do that anymore. And clear some out. Gosh. One message was... Oh, wait. Okay. We got one message. Uh, one message was a spoiler, I guess. Just be careful on the spoilers. All right, my friends. <clears throat> Um, it's good to work. Uh, it's off to work to save some animals. I hope everyone has a good day. Have a good scary stream. Appreciate that, Marla. Hope you have a great day yourself. Uh, if you got dogs, you can put channel rewards for that. I have mine set up at 20,000 to bring my dogs on stream. Oh, gosh. Uh, that would be a really good idea if my dogs were about a quarter of the size that they are. Um, and about a quarter as, uh, excitable as they are, too. <laughs> the guy was a regular motor mouth <laughs> never said it for a day if you say so I feel like I'm the more alert one here between the two of us I'm pretty sure you said it way 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 back when but but it's okay can I fake spoil and well I mean if it's something clearly obviously fake uh, I guess that's fine 
Backseat's good, not spoiling. Wait. Backseat's good, not spoiling. Could have went with, oh yeah. <laughs> Very important puppet. Yeah, so the, the thing about the, the dog, so my Doberman, if I tried bringing her in here, like the whole stream setup would get destroyed. That's just kind of how it would go. Uh, my Coonhound may or may not, but it also they're they're not easy enough to like pick up uh, and put on my lap. And if I tried picking them up and put them on my lap, they'd like flail all around. And uh, the Doberman's about 75 pounds and the Coonhound's about 65 pounds. So they're, I mean, they're pretty good sized dogs. They're not huge, but they're pretty good sized. Oh, it's a backseat, not a spoiler. Gotcha. Around December, I believe. That's what I thought, too. That's what I thought, too. Wait, do I have... I have no ammo. Oh. <laughs> okay. That's real good. Uh, I went all the way around to go to the Duke at the end of the last stream, and I, apparently I didn't have to, but... Uh, I might need to get Welcome. some ammo crafted here. I, may, I, I can't even make any. Well, son of a gun. What happened to all my ammo? I thought I had a bunch. Does it, it doesn't use different ammo, right? No. What what happened to it? Does anybody remember? Did I just use a, an absolute ton of ammo? I remember there were a bunch of lichens at one point, but I thought I stocked back up. My fake spoilers are so obvious they can't be mistaken for a real one. Perhaps he hasn't laid eyes on. Yeah, I thought I crafted up a, a lot too, and it says I've got nothing in here, so I don't know. Uh, like jam the non-existent crowbar in the prop. It'll be like flipping a bike. <laughs> That'd be pretty cool, though. If you could. That was the way to beat that bad guy. Um, I might buy a couple. Then again, it's one bullet, isn't it? Didn't somebody say that? These are for one bullet. Well, I guess we're about to find out. Yeah, that's unreal. That is unfreaking real. Okay. What a turd. I think it was Covert who told me that. That is ridiculous. Um, I guess I'm just gonna we're just gonna have to see what happens here. I might need to do some more exploring in these places to see if there is some ammo. And I didn't want to. I didn't want to make it an exploring stream today, but I might have to. Otherwise, I might die. Um. Yeah. Uh, I did spend quite a bit in the cave with that giant, and with all the hordes, that was quite a while ago. Yeah. Yeah, I suppose. Uh, just, And I can't even go back this way, can I? I have to go all the way around. Ethan eats his bullets, so be careful not to save them for too long. <laughs> oh, I brought the duke up here, so there's no going back anymore. Good. That's awesome. That's great news. That's great news. Oh, wait, there's a ladder, but it's an, it's only an up ladder. Okay. Well, good. Oh, this is a down ladder? No, no, of course not. All right. Good. What I tell you? I think you told me about the bullet cost. Uh, the cost only being for one bullet. I thought it was. Anime present, destruction imminent. Got a long imminent. Way to go. <laughs> what did I say? Don't forget, if you upgrade a gun, you'll get ammo back. Oh, that's true. Can I upgrade this gun? Is there an upgrade uh, possible? I don't know how much I'll get, but let's do let's give it a shot. The handgun has been very important for me. I've been using that one a lot. Welcome, Ethan. Um Oh yeah, we can definitely upgrade, right? Do we do power? Ammo capacity? Maybe reload speed? Let's do a reload speed. These hands are more dexterous than Alright, how much does that give me? No new yeah. ammo. Crap. Okay. Seeking something in particular. Well, do I, do I need to like spend the ammo that's in there? Is that what I would need to do? Make sure it's empty before you do. Oh, so I should just start like shooting it everywhere. That's definitely not going to get clipped. Um, okay. This is not a, uh, not a work message, so we're good. Um, ammo capacity. Okay, so so I should just start, just start blasting, right? Empty this this gun totally. I've got okay, eleven. Then. So would that give me fifteen if I do that? Um, let's see. Are you still off work today? By the way, 
All my days are blended in one. No, no, I've been back to work this week. So out of context loots. Yeah, we're going to have a nice segment on that. This is the first time I see Duke's stomach disgusting. Don't need to empty it. Wait, okay, so what should I do? Oh, it only gives me a full clip. Okay, I I get what you're saying. Okay, okay. So, if it's just looking, oh, what is the ammo away. capacity of this gun? It says the ammo capacity is 12, but it didn't give me an extra bullet. So, <laughs> don't forget the hidden chest. Heisberg has a chest in which there's a blue crystal. <laughs> sniper wolf. I do. So I am gonna use the sniper. The sniper has been amazing. I've been loving the sniper. Uh, I've also got the the magnum, or as I like to call it, the man gum. Uh, but the ammo on that is kind of hard to come by. So I could do some upgrades. I don't have a whole lot of, uh, a whole lot of, uh, cash, unfortunately. But maybe I'll do, you know what? Let's upgrade the reload speed on the sniper. What? Oh, it's fine. So that's fully upgraded. Um, we're going to use the sniper, I think, quite a bit. The rate of fire would also be good to up upgrade. Uh, so yeah. Sniper is what I got the most ammo in right now, but Breaking Bad Heisenberg reference. It's all good. I knew you were not referring to this game. Uh, am I going to get a chance to catch these other fish that I need? Probably not. I don't think there's... I mean, I could sell some things if I really wanted. But. All right. Till next we meet. We'll just use the sniper for a little while. It's uh, It's nicely upgraded. Um, what else was up here? Isn't the Magnum kind of just, uh, kind of like a joke at the po this point since there's never any ammo ever? Uh, I've been, I, I haven't been using a whole lot of ammo, uh, for my man gum, but, uh, I, I probably, uh, I, I don't know, I have some at least. So. I didn't miss anything down here, did I? Yeah, it's just the dead end, right? There wasn't anywhere else for me to go, was there? Now I'm second guessing myself. No, there's nowhere to go on that platform. Okay, I'm going the only way I can. The magnums are really strong, but they are so slow. I don't like them. Just let me pump a thousand bullets per minute in my enemy. Kills bosses real quick, so perhaps not. Yeah. Yeah, I'm trying to. I'm trying to save up. Uh, I did use it a couple times so far, but are those bodies? They are bodies, but they are. Uh, well, they're not exactly, uh, they're not exactly humans. They're not exactly not humans either, but. Ooh, sniper ammo. Yes, please. Yeah. I don't know. Hopefully we can keep going with the sniper, but better save the best gun for last. Yeah. Yeah. And that's what, uh, that's what I had been told. Some people were like, All right. oh, you sure you want to use Magnum ammo? This Hooray, is a very nice hint. For nothing but children. She doesn't care for us. No. She's long lost all her humanity. Okay. I must destroy her. What is this? I don't give a shit about your family drama. Something's twitching over here. The metal army? Yeah. Remember saving the Magnum in RE2 remake? You can never use it, just a waste of inventory space. Oh, you never seen this part, Nander? Curry says that she's excited. Okay, this guy wasn't supposed to give away his position like that. Oh. I guess he was. Ethan does not run fast backwards, so. Oh, what? I did not think those helmets were that strong. I did not think those helmets were that strong. Okay, I'm not doing that again. At least I know now. No scope him. Yeah, those shield goggles. Who knew? I didn't know they were that strong. I'm going to use a pistol ammo for that. I think one shot with a pistol will do it too. Yeah, see? Kind of crap. I actually don't think it matters where you shoot them. So I don't need to aim for the head. I'll just aim for center mass. Try to save some stuff. Pipe bomb, pipe bomb, herb, and some gunpowder. Okay. Oh, you said shield googles. I didn't even notice. 
Field Googles actually sounds even cooler, though. True Kelt continuing the gift sub they got from Lady Iron. I'll give you a cheers for that. It doesn't, uh, for some reason, it doesn't do that. I don't know why. Uh, it does not trigger an alert on Twitch's end. So, cheers. Appreciate that, True Kelt. And, of course, thank you, Lady Iron, for the gift sub to True Kelt. In RE4, I saved my Killer7 and Broken Butterfly for the big boss. Sadly, and the, or Sadler, and the Tongue Guy. <laughs> no scope, yeah, the no scope is not going to go very well. I don't even, I don't even know if you can, can you? You probably can. Dragon ammo is good too. I mean, I'll take any ammo at this point. Yeah, I know I can craft ammo, kind of. Ooh, we got a shiny. Large crystal. Son of a gun, there was one behind me. Okay, so I guess the other question is, if I can shoot him in the body... Oh, okay, I can't shoot him in the body. I gotta shoot him in the head. So if you can shoot him in... I was gonna say, if you can shoot him in the body, I guess there's no point in shooting their helmets off, but you can't, actually, so... Sings the alert for Kel. Da, da, da. <laughs> Ooh, a lockpick? Am I gonna still need that? Oh, we're definitely going through there. Okay, did I clear this? I did. Check that out. Does Twitch support surround? Because I heard that zombie in my surround speaker. Oh, I don't know. Potentially? I don't know if it has anything to do with my, like, my audio settings or not, but. <laughs> my eyebrow is getting heavy. Oh, no. Uh, is anyone watching the CGI animated RE show on Netflix? Yeah, we were just talking about that, actually, Ali Fox. I uh, just dropped yesterday and just watched the first episode. It's really interesting. Yeah, we were just talking a little bit about that. So I'm glad that you're uh, enjoying at least the first episode. I'll need to check that out, too. I'll add that to my watch list because, uh. That'll be another thing that Mrs. Magoots probably won't want to watch. Um, loved, I need to finish Love, Death, Robots first, but that's super easy. Those shows are very short. Okay, we need a pipe bomb for this area. And I'm guessing I got to go this way at some point. Yeah, okay. Pipe bomb! We will be over the weekend. So excited. Yeah, I'm sure we'll hear, uh, Curry, what you think, but be sure to, to fill us in. Let's equip this. DJ Khaled, another one. Uh, I'm laid on my side, so my left eye is squished against my pillow, so it's just the right one is getting affected by my lap lack of sleep. Please, handgun ammo. Vivianite, large crystal, yellow quartz. This is all fine and dandy, except for ammo is too expensive to buy. Uh, especially when you want gun upgrades. Did that clear the room? It did. Another one. I'm watching, uh, and I made it through episode two. Nice. I was just watching Love, Death, and Robots yesterday. Uh, what episode uh, are you on the second season, Coleman? That's what the one I'm on, and I, I'm trying to remember which episode I just finished. Can't remember. Oh, yeah, this looks good. What could possibly go wrong in this room? Um, maybe I should shoot that. Yeah, I'm going to shoot that. Although, I don't know if I should use this gun. Hmm, I could use the grenade launcher. No, I'm, I'm just, I'm just going to use the, I'm just going to use the handgun. It is what it is at this point. Oh, there are four of those. Okay, fun. <sighs> oh, you mean like that? Oh, gosh. Need to... Really need there to be no no enemies in here, or very few. Can I craft anything of value? Okay, I can make... Oh, okay. There we go. Okay, I at least have 30 handgun ammo now, plus the five I already had. 
or six, however many I had, so. Could be the sound driver uh, slash settings trying to position the sound virtually. I highly doubt there's surround audio streaming. Yeah, I mean, I'm not doing anything special, at least, I don't think. No. This one's pretty short, too. Only four episodes, 30 minutes each. Oh, okay, gotcha, gotcha. Gotcha. I, I definitely am intrigued. Definitely am intrigued. I need to get more into the RE universe. I've been enjoying my time in it. After finishing RE8, do a knife only challenge, please. Oh gosh. Uh, that's a big negative, Another Ghost Rider. One. That is a big negative, Ghost Rider. Ooh! Oh. Come on now. You gotta die after this. Come on. He did not pull the trigger. Wait, somebody behind me too? Oh, I'm dead. I think I might have just died. Oh no, he let me through. <laughs> what a dummy. Uh, I need mines. Mines are the mines are what I need right now. I might get caught in that explosion. Oh my gosh. Can I make another mine? Oh my goodness. Whew. They did add extra missions to Wildlands, by the way. It feels like there's so much more content. Uh, played 10 hours so far? Nice, okay. Now you've jinxed yourself, of course. What's going on, P. Magoo? Welcome in. Good morning. And Extreme. Hello there. Quite a bit of content. I've done all the main story, but there were some update missions I haven't done yet. Like the Rainbow Six ones. Gotcha. Uh, Lutz isn't a pro gamer. A knife only run would make him would take him a lifetime. <laughs> I mean, I you know I let's just put it this way. I wouldn't have any fun doing it. I wouldn't have any fun. So, hey, what's going on, Phil? Welcome back in, Phil. Hope you're having a good day thus far, my friend. Uh, yeah, it just doesn't sound like uh, it doesn't sound like a fun game to me. Um, I'm just trying to think of how to fight, uh, like fighting. Um, Really, any of the bosses with only a knife? That just doesn't sound fun. That's the challenge, though. That's why you do knife only on easy. It didn't take me long at all to complete on PS4, and since Nidalicious gifted to me recently, it seems there's way more missions to do. Oh, okay. Case in point. What's a drill in the chest, anyway? I know. What, you know, what's the big deal? What's the big deal? What's everybody getting all upset about, anyway? Uh, do pipe bombs? I don't have enough rusted scrap for this. I don't know why all these weapons use rusted scrap. Shotgun ammo. Okay, so the shotgun is relatively ineffective on these guys. Seems. Uh, I'm going to try the pipe bomb. I have no idea if this will work or not, but I at least have a couple of them. What is this? What? What? What was up with that laser? Oh, I freaking missed. Yeah, I'm probably going to die here. This is uh this is unfortunate. Okay, is he is he invulnerable in that state? I'm confused. What am I supposed to do here? Have something to do with this? Hang on a second. I gotta shoot. I'm gonna shoot these little uh, these thingies. I don't think this is gonna. I don't know if this is gonna do anything for me or not, but I gotta try. We'll say you unlock a significantly stronger knife on New Game Plus. Is that is that right? Gosh, it's my turn. Does this do anything? Everything's on fire right now. I oh, know, just stop spinning so I can advance. Okay, good. Glad to see it. These guys are obnoxious. It's like the right time I got in here. Yeah, you're, uh, you got here just in time. This guy's definitely gonna follow me, right? I don't know where he went, but he's 
You can jump right up here, right? The other thing is they, they tend to drop valuable stuff, so I I kind of need them. I think I figured out the laser. It is shown when the guy's about to sprint and shows where he's going to sprint to. Could be. It's weird, though. He turned... He had a laser, and then he, he went kind of a different direction. But maybe it's because he went, like, down the... Maybe it's because he went down the line uh, of the uh, the handle, uh, whatever you want to call it, the side railing here. And he doesn't have a weak spot on his back. Where did the other guy die at? Somewhere... Somewhere at the top of some stairs, I think. Can I shoot his jetpack? I guess his... Yeah, the shotgun seems to be the most effective at hitting that spot on him. Maybe not, though. He's very good at protecting it. Yeah, see, that's uh, that's just so much resources to, to, to spend just to get some more money. But... Then again, I might have missed out on that rusted scrap. So, pro tip, you can block. Yeah, I know. I keep forgetting about that, too. I'm also trying to get that shot in there at the last second. Okay, this is cleared. Ooh, this is called the grinder shaft. <laughs> nice. Very nice. What a what a nice name. Yeah, I do need to use the blocking. I always forget because it doesn't seem like arms, you know, holding your arms up like this should uh, should stop a, a rotating drill. But, you know, it turns out it does actually pretty effectively since I've got a couple uh, a couple of the Duke's meals. What's a better name? Grinder shaft or spank tower? <laughs> I don't know. You take a vote on that. Grinder shaft or spank tower. Oh, that's cool. Big empty room. The hand. Oh, yes. The hand. You get a good, nice close-up of the hand there. Alright. I think we just got an auto-save, so that's good. <sighs> Factory map. Upper levels. Okay. You know what I haven't done, though, in a while is read the journal. Um... How do I get to the journal again? Is it under the map? Okay, here it is. Yeah, where did I leave off? Um. Yeah, okay. I think it was right here, maybe. I ran into Chris and his goons in a shock by the in a shack by the lake. They seem to be researching something. What are they up to? I had so many questions, but then that giant fish turns out was Moreau attacked. I need to get out of here, but he said the exit was underwater. Uh, February 9th afternoon, Moreau's hut. Moreau's belly uh, up. Moreau is belly up, and I'm almost out of the lake. Then who shows up at last child Heisenberg? Not in person, of course, through a dusty old TV. He told me the last flask is in some stronghold. I'm not going to let him have his way, but I, I don't have many other options right now. This better not be a trick. Evening in the stronghold. I finally have all four flasks, but Heisenberg said I needed to do one more thing to heal her. Take all the flasks to the altar. Will this really heal her? Can I trust Heisenberg? Edge of the bridge. I put the four flasks in the giant's chalice, uh, then moved it to the ceremony site where the ground gave way and a stone bridge appeared. There's some kind of gar gar garage or warehouse on the other side. Heisenberg's place, I presume? I don't want to be apart from Rose, but there's only a little left to do. Wait for me, my dear. Factory underground. Heisenberg asked me to help him, but he just wants to use Rose against Miranda. Miranda, Heisenberg, they're all the same, fighting over Rose's power. Something that's no match for any of them? Crazy. I mean, Rose is, she's just a baby. I need to get to the service so I can save her. Eh, I don't think he's right about that. Always read the journal. What's the game without the backstory? I know. The uh, the thing is, it doesn't... I, unless I'm totally missing it, I don't think it tells me when I got a journal update. So I don't really think about it. 
Hmm. Is this wall? And oh, it looks like there's another entrance. Potentially? Ah, okay. Gonna move this. Okay. Crouch down in here. Hey, what's going on, Killa Corgi? How you doing? Welcome in. Happy Friday. Happy Friday. Ams? We got Ams up in here continuing the gift sub they got from Litany. Cheers. Thank you so much, Ams. Uh, again, it's same same as um same as True Kelt. It doesn't give you a, an alert for that. So I'm going to give you a cheers anyway, though. Thank you so much, Ams, as well as Litany for gifting the sub. I appreciate you both. Hope everybody's having a good Friday thus far. Of course, love the content. I, I appreciate that. I do. Oh, a ball mold? Okay. And handgun ammo. 30 handgun ammo. Yes, please. A ball mold. I'm sure there's jokes to be made there, but, you know. Okay, that is cleared now. Cheers from Dr. Trip Chance. Cheers. <clears throat> oh. All right. So. Oh, wait. How did I miss? Wow. Okay. I missed this chem fluid right here. And then this here. Soldat jet. Uh, attach a jetpack and head stabilizers to a soldat. Greatly improves mobility. Experiments prove limited flight capabilities. No long distance flight, but now possible to navigate rugged terrain. And there's a soldat panzer. Attach aluminum alloy shielding to a soldat to protect chest reactor and expose flesh. Experimentation proves he is invincible against regular firearms. Armor doesn't hold up against strong blasts. Further development needed. Yeah, so it's really just the the dang um, mines. Maybe the grenade launcher would be good too. Just wanted to see what that tankard is. Oh. The uh, Sea of Thieves tankard that I drink out of? I can just show it to you. See if these tankard, hand painted. Um, eventually I'll be getting my own tankard, but you know, until then, we got the Sea of Thieves. Oh, I need to work on that. Just add it to my list. Alright, we are actually starting to get some respectable amount of handgun ammo for a change. Oh. Kind of like a really uncomfortable poop that was going on. Uh, I'm glad it wasn't. I don't know which is worse though, flying into a into a, a deadly fan or taking a really rough poop. I don't know. I'm loving Sea of Thieves. I only played it twice. Had so much fun. Oh, Sea of Thieves is so good. It's so good. I was reading as Tank Yard. That was the problem. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> Does it say tank yard? What do we got here? More yellow quartz. Yellow quartz is super valuable. I think it's like 10k. So it's uh was it a recent? Is it is it recent uh you play in Sea of Thieves? Ams? You only played twice, but were both times recently. Uh, we got a couple people that play. Um, I play... Oh, there's a goat. Um, I play... I know Coleman has played. Um, I think Coleman's still been playing it. Um, we got a couple others. Uh, a couple of my other friends that play it. Brokey and Waylon. So. Played for Annie's B-Day, so a few weeks ago. Gotcha. Okay. Very nice. Has, uh, has Annie been playing it for a while? I really considered uh, trying to get a crew together for my birthday, but uh, it turned out we actually have more people uh, that wanted to wanted to hop in. So in Sea of Thieves, you can only have three other people with you. So, um, so it ended up being good to, to to do Valheim instead. Oh, okay, this is not missed something else. What else is there? Not as much recently, but I've been doing the new Tall Tales. I need to get on that. I need to get on that, but. Uh, she played more than me. I gotcha. I've been seeing you playing it late at night sometimes. Yeah, so um, Brokey and Waylon are bad influences because they uh, they're on Central Time. So when they want to play, it's already it's already late for me. 
but I'm like, well, I'm not going to turn down the opportunity to play Sea of Thieves with a crew. So, um, so I, I hop in with them and, uh, unlike one of my other friends who plays, they don't really tell me, uh, it's getting too late. Um, you know, around midnight, they usually wait till about 2 AM. <laughs> so, so I need somebody to be like my, uh, I need the, the bartender to just cut me off. You know what I mean? That's kind of the type of person I need to play with, but, uh, but it's a lot of fun. I, I really enjoy playing with them, uh, but I do sometimes get myself into trouble. So want to do the tall tales too. I've been hearing good things, uh, except for, I think the second one was bugged for a while. I don't know if it's fixed yet. In the same way with Overwatch, is that right? Just, oh, just one more game. Yeah, see if these can do that too, because it's like you go to turn in all your treasure and the next thing you know, it's like, oh, but look, there's something interesting, like just right over there. It's just right there. Why don't I check it out? And the next thing you know, three hours later, uh, you, you, yeah, you just, you, you get, you, you're done for. But, I mean, playing Valheim for sure. Uh, for your next play along with fans, Jackbox Games has some really fun games that allow a bunch to easily participate. So we did actually do uh, Jackbox Guild Night one time. These are these are yellow. Is there? Does that mean I need to do something? Probably not. Probably just means that are movable. I don't know what I'm missing here. I don't know what I'm missing. I mean, it, it's possible. It is somewhat possible. It could be something down here, but probably not. Yeah, we did we did Jackbox um, at the end of February actually uh, for the very first Guild Night. We did uh, we did Jackbox. Gave away like 60 some games. It was a good time. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Like a gem somewhere, but I haven't I haven't located it. Oh. One minute chess. Really need someone to tell me to stop. Wait, so one minute chess is a game that you play late? Civ six or Stardew for me? Yeah. Yeah, Drawful in Jackbox games is pretty good. Uh there's some good ones. I've got I've got Jackbox four through six, I believe, on this PC. Um from the guild night so i mean i've got a good number of games but uh i, I thought i had access to an older one too kind of worried about going this way because i feel like i'm not gonna be able to come back well all right, we'll see maybe i can yeah he can come back there's a gem on the platform when you came front flying in oh like up here which would mean there's nothing i could do Right? Or, oh, it's that. Is it this? Is that something? No, that's just... Yeah, I don't know what it is. Hey, what's going on, Jess? It's called bullet chess? Really? Okay. What about the edge in the back? Yeah, I don't know. I... I'm sure what I'm... I'm trying to look high, but... <laughs> look high, oh gosh. I'm trying to look up high, but... Oh, wait a minute. I already grabbed some from over here. I guess I missed a second thing. All right, there we go. <laughs> Only Jackbox I have is Party Pack Seven. Oh, there's a seven. I haven't I haven't seen that one, uh, Doctor D. Appreciate the the help, everybody, on finding that. I I did pick up one thing, but I guess there was a second thing. That's all right. Uh, I am known to miss uh, objects right out in the open. Okay, this uh, breathing in all these fumes ought to be good for me. Is there treasure to find in here? Doesn't seem like it. I think I have four on my switch though. Okay, four is four is pretty good. Honestly, I I like the the good thing about Jackbox is even if there's a game you don't like, there's probably multiple games that you would like. You know. Just chess with the time set for one minute, you get that just one more game feel and hours fly by. So so when you say the game, so the entire game is one minute or you you only get one minute per move? Because one minute per move would not be very uh, not be very short at all. I assume it's one minute per game. So what do they do then to decide the winner? Is it just whoever has like the best pieces remaining in that one minute? Soon I am uh, she'll start her ceremony with your I am not a big chess moves. player. I like playing chess, but I, I don't play it regularly. It's all over. For your kid. And for the whole village. But don't worry. I'll stop it. I'll use Rose to kill Miranda. <laughs> Poor Papa. 
You're the only one who doesn't see your kid's power. Take Rose? <laughs> I'd like to see you try. <laughs> really, Ethan? I mean, really, dude? Really? We're going to start talking trash in this position? If you ever want to play a board game, I've got a subscription to a software that I can scan my games into to play online, too. I've got some good party games. Oh, really? You'll have to give me some info on that, Coleman. That sounds pretty cool. Competitive is a strong word, but I do enjoy turn-based strategy for sure. Competitive strategy gamer, I got gotcha. you. <laughs> Almost like a drug. Agree, I'm 2300 rate. I'm dead addicted to chess. Your player has one minute to finish the game. Okay, if your timer runs out, you lose. Huh, okay. Carlson's a pretty big bullet player, right? The time they're lost unless the opponent has no pieces. Okay. He's good, yeah, but better in classic, I would say. Ethan do be talking mad trash. I know, it's ridiculous, right? I'd like to see you try. And I like I'm not even face to face with Heisenberg here. I, I mean, I just ran away screaming from his dad or whoever, you know, his, the other creation in here. I just ran away screaming. And he's like, <laughs> I'd like to see you try. We get here, another mold, another ball mold. Oh, key mold, okay. Right, when am I going to do my smelting? More handgun ammo, of course. Okay. Where am I in relation to, say, the Duke? Not close. Uh, is there an online version of Players Against Humanity? Oh. Cards Against Humanity? Or is it? Is there a different version called Players? Cards Against Humanity. Okay, okay. I was going to say, I didn't know about uh, Players Against Humanity. I was like, oh, There's is more. there another game? There's more? Man, this factory just goes on forever. It really does, though. I mean, look at that. That's where I came in over there, somewhere uh, on that platform. So it's been a, it's been a trip. Does this bring the Duke up? Magnus Carlson? Uh, I don't know Magnus Carlson. I don't. Uh, I assume you meant to tag uh, Nidalicious, though. Uh, hover around 1,000, 1,200 at my best. Seen that? Not sure if it's an official one. Yeah, I don't, I don't know. I'm trying to remember the last time I played Cards Against Humanity. It's been a little while. It's been a little while. Um, I have this game that's pretty cool, but it would be better with more players. Mrs. Magoots and I play, um, or we've played a couple times ourselves. Because you can play with two players. Um, but I think you can actually play with up to like six or something like that. Uh, it's called Mixtape Massacre. Actually, we so we have uh, Escape from Tall Oaks, but they're the same company, basically. Uh, I want I want to give them a shot with uh, with a full full set of people sometime. That'd be pretty cool. All right, we got a decent amount of stuff to sell. All right, I haven't found out what to attach this uh, cylinder to yet, but hopefully soon. Hopefully soon. As always, a trustworthy fair right. exchange. And then I could do some upgrades on the handgun, I suppose. I I don't know what to do. To hunger. Can I buy mines? Here's I can the buy eye. mines. They're fairly cheap, too. Hmm. Surprised more. Uh, I'm surprised that Extreme Broadside knows Carlson. I'm kind of obligated to know about Carlson as a resident of Norway. I got gotcha. you. You know anything about chess? You know about Magnus? Hmm. Well, that explains why I don't know who he is. That explains it. Increased capacity cylinders, 100,000. Ooh, okay. But why would you need increased capacity for the Magnum? For the man gum? I don't even have enough bullets to fill up the current uh, chamber. Okay. Uh, I could buy mines. He's got four of them. I don't know. That might not be a bad idea just to save on my crafting supplies. I think I'm going to do that. Okay. Uh, and then I can probably upgrade at least something on this handgun. Rate of fire, reload speed, ammo capacity. Let's go with the uh, rate of fire. I don't know. Let's I don't know what to choose. You guys seen that video of Nakamura playing uh, pre-playing all moves against Carlson and winning? I I've not, but I know you weren't asking me. <laughs> 
41 K for 1200 power. Uh, that would be pretty good. Ammo capacity too. I don't know what to do. More power in the shotgun, 1250. Then again, the shotgun does actually work when the, when I run out of the, uh, I'm gonna upgrade that. When I run out of the mines, that seems to work the best. More power, power and ammo capacity are a good bet. Yeah, for sure. Always update power. Gimmick video never happened, is that right? Till next we meet. All right. Um, mm, 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 we'll save over some of the village parts. Okay. All right. Um, well, we'll do our best here. I have a. Uh, I have a key, right? Oh, I need the key mold. Okay. Okay. All right. I have a key mold and a ball mold to use. A mold for creating a ball using cast iron. Okay. All right, I gotta go back to the smelter. Um, can I use this? Ah, okay, here's how I get back. That's nice. <clears throat> Didn't know we had so many chest aficionados. Yeah, I occasionally try to convince Mrs. Magoot to play chess with me, and that's that's about the extent of my chess playing. That is about the extent. It's dark. It's dark. <laughs> yeah, no kidding, Ethan. All right, the smelter smelter is in where again? Oh, and I still need to see if there's anything in this room. Okay. Should probably check that out at some point. Smelter, I think is wasn't it through freaking a? Are you serious? Okay, that upgraded power. Not bad. Not bad. Two shots on those ones. That's pretty good. That's pretty decent. Um, smelter, where are you? Oh, and there's something in this room too? In this one right here? There is! Oh my gosh, okay. Trying to quit chess? You're trying to quit chess? Are you just not enjoying it as much anymore? I thought you said you were super addicted. What, what, um... What on? What do we think I left out? Oh boy! One. Oh, missed that one. Two. Crystal mechanical heart. Great. That doesn't get it cleared for me, does it? Oh, I'm not in the same room anymore. Okay. So the thing is here. Okay. All right, let's go with the key mold, and then we'll do the ball mold. I, I'm good at chess, but I have other affairs to attend to. That makes sense. That makes sense. All right, we got Heisenberg's key. What are we going to do with this ball, though? Is this one of those, like, puzzle games? Like in the meme. But my quitting program didn't work out. <laughs> I'm gonna say 50% off, so I said I'm an extra large pepperoni feast pizza. Does that just have like a ton of pepperoni on it? Iron horse ball. Okay. I wonder when that's gonna come in handy. Is there there's something over here? A switch? Heisenberg's key. Okay. There's something missing. I, I haven't gotten everything here in the foundry. And something up here, too. Where does this ball go, though? Um, Heisenberg's key again? Another one? Or is that... Maybe that's the one? 
That's the other side of the door, possibly. I'm not sure. First floor here. Okay, and that's all the higher I can go in the factory. Okay. Where am I currently at? B5? B4? I'm on MB4. It, like, like these mean anything to me. I, I mean, <laughs> might as well be on R2D2. Like, I have no idea where the heck I'm at. B plus on King Queen Hotties oh, Gosh, no, I do not. Pizza, yeah, pizza does sound good. Uh, I actually had a slice of pizza uh, two days ago. It was nice. It was nice. Uh, it was actually from. It was Casey's. I was trying to tell uh, Balinor about Casey's General Store. Um, I, I joined the Casey's Rewards and they gave me a free slice for joining. So I was like, yeah, I'm gonna take this. I I shared it with Mrs. Magoots though. I didn't just eat it by myself. Um, I was I was a good sharer. Extra cheese, extra sauce, extra pepperoni. Okay. Okay. So you like extra sauce too, huh? Saw the room when you arrived in the factory, I believe. The room with the puzzle. Oh, okay. Okay. When I arrived in the factory. I thought there would be like an exclamation point like there is here. But um, I guess not. We will. I can go ahead and go straight through here and use Heisenberg's key here. This is a separate area. Heisenberg's quarters. I don't know if that's going to trigger a ne the next part of the game or what, but I guess we'll find out. Um, there's something to find in here. Uh, could it be a shiny? Yes, there is, at least. Uh, is one of these doors locked? Is that door locked? No. Could be down this hallway, I suppose. Is there a shiny? Hmm. Just got booked for a DJ gig on the 24th. Very nice. Congrats on that, Nidalicious. Uh, is it, is it like a private party or is it going to be a, uh, or well, a party, I guess. I don't know that's necessarily a party, but I guess if there's music for, with DJs there, it's a party, right? Is it, is it a private one or is it going to be something similar to what you did, um, in the park? Um, first floor B3, I think there's room to the right of the elevator, uh, slash Duke B4. Okay. B4, huh? So is that, Okay. B4. Room to the right of the Duke. Oh. Oh, like this area here? Ah, okay. Okay. Alright. We'll check that out then pretty soon here. Um, I don't I'm not sure what I'm missing in here, unless there's something I can get, like a, a reward I can get from one of these molds. That could be. Or it's this over here. Yeah, I found it. <laughs> Got it. That was hard. Let's go through here. We'll use Heisenberg's key to get into his quarters. There are two places to use the Heisenberg key. This is one of them. Heisenberg's key. Sharing is caring indeed. Domino sauce is nice. The only joint I feel that way about. Really? Um, you unlocked it. Yeah, imagine that. Okay. Um, oh, good. This is this is gonna be fun. I think I just normally just shot these guys, didn't I? Yeah, because it's not that much more damage. Kind of aim for center mass, and you can shish kebab them a little bit, so maybe I can get a two for here. Yeah, look at that. Two for. Oh, yes. Give me all that rusted scrap. Yes, please. <clears throat> Yeah, so Domino's pizza sauce. I can't. It's been a while since I've had Domino's, so I can't really remember what it's like. The place we went for my birthday had really good sauce. I really enjoyed it. Um, we definitely had more Papa John's lately than Domino's. What we got here mechanical part shaft. Ah, okay. So this is what I'm gonna make uh, by combining stuff. A junk piece of steel. Yeah, okay. So let's combine these. And this made like a hammer of some sort. I'm going to try to inspect this real quick. I don't know if it's going to matter by inspecting it. Hmm. Okay. Heisenberg's hammer. 
It's too heavy to use. Okay. <laughs> so it's just very valuable. All right. The lawnmower keep your yard tight. It did kind of look like a lawnmower, didn't it? <laughs> All right. Uh, wait. It's showing these being connected, but I guess not. Not in a way I can actually. Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. Well, good. Can get more upgrades, I guess. Uh, I do not want to go this way, right? Or maybe I. No, I don't want to go this way. I want to go back in through the foundry. Foundry, foundry. And then I think this way? Yes. I'm going to find out what this switch is all about up here. This was something that didn't have enough power or something? I can't really remember. Yeah, through here. There we go. Yeah, this didn't have enough power last time I was up here. Oh, that's okay. That's fun. You see your enemies in the next room. That's always great. I mean, I guess better than not seeing them at all, but, um, just something to look forward to. Yeah, these guys are definitely coming to life. Definitely coming to life. No way they don't. Right? Um, I haven't tried the grenade launcher on him though. Maybe I'll maybe I'll equip that. Did I clear the room at least? I haven't yet. Okay. Oh, I should have reloaded first. Probably wasn't the best idea ever. Okay, so this is this pretty much a failure. Pretty much a failure there on that. At least I know. It also seemed more like a flashbang than... I don't know if that... It shouldn't have been a flashbang. It should have been an explosive round. What is this? Ooh. Is this a treasure? It was a flashbang? See, that's what I thought. <laughs> so he's you. You had two flash rounds is why? That's super strange. I thought I switched my ammo, though. Medical log. Revitalization surgery. Okay, this, this is cleared is now. my 18th attempt. The subject is Oscar the Stable Boy, 20 years old. Making cyborg people. Fell down the well while drunk. Body is in good condition. <laughs> Chest incision complete. Heisenberg's a Heisenberg's a freak. Heart and vital organs, and implant the control device. Excellent. Cadeau has begun adhering to the nervous system. It's progressing even faster than before. It seems upping the ratio of meta-albumin in the artificial blood was the right choice. Now to pass a current through the brain stem using 6,600 volts. Come on. It has to work this time. Yes. Is this yes. the first one? <laughs> it's been his Wonderful. first cyborg. My creation. At last. I'll get that bitch yet. <laughs> Ending recording. He lets me know when it's over. Okay, well, can I get out of here without anybody else waking up? Surprisingly, I can. Check that out. All right. We got some good stuff in there. Uh, did I already? I didn't think, I don't think I equipped this yet. Okay. Magnum's got the enhanced barrel. Uh, so now all it needs is the other upgrade, which is, I think, too expensive for it to be worth it, but. Okay. Let's try to get back through. He said a bad word. <laughs> He did. He's not the only one. Ethan says bad words all the time. Is this the way? Yeah. 
I want to turn right and then go left through here. Right? And then go around this way through here, I think. Kind of sort of making it up. Nope, that's not the way I want to go. Okay. Can I go back? Ethan's a sailor, surely. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. Okay. Try not to. So do I still need to make more items in the, the foundry? And where's that? How do I get back to that room? Just right around here. There's a room nearby that I have not. I'm missing something else in. Uh, yeah, it's this one here. Okay. Something I'm missing. Oh, there it is. Found it. Oh, no freaking way. One of these guys? Are you kidding me? I don't like that auto block. I don't like it. Perfect crystal mechanical heart. That's a new one. Whew. All right. Ethan has a reason. Which ones did you make in the foundry so far? Oh, crap. Um, the last two that I just made, I made Heisenberg's key and uh, some iron horse ball, I think. I think this is the last thing I'm missing in here, too. There's a shiny right there. Hopefully that's it. Perfect. Okay. So I go back through down here, I think, to get back to Duke. Yes, yes. I go all the way back around this way. This way was cleared out, though. Uh, looked away while ordering dominoes. They're not arriving till 1130. Are you serious? All right, another one? What the heck is this crap? What is this garbage? On two mines? How is this dude not dead? Really? How is this guy not dead? I don't like those guys. I do not freaking like them. Two mines. And then, like, what, four or five shotgun blasts? I don't like it. That's way too much. That's way too many resources. Ugh. Uh, let's see. Looks like it might be a bit of a conspiracy event, though. Oh, really? They're protesting the effects that lockdown, social distancing, mask mandate, forced testing, and forced vaccination is having on people. Oh, gosh. Does RE have a nemesis? Because that kind of looked like a nemesis. I don't know. How is Ethan not dead? No, oh, they're not hitting me in my weak spot, apparently. Shall I choose something for you? All right, let's see what I can get rid of here. Offload. We got yellow quartz, polycrystal skull. I wonder how much Heisenberg's hammer is only worth 45k. That's much less than some of the others. Uh, the perfect crystal uh, mechanical hearts are pretty decent, though. Okay. 123,000. No, no, I'm more than happy to purchase it. Uh, let's upgrade. I'm not even gonna be able to get that much power out of these. Maybe I'll do the shotgun instead. No. 1330, I've been relying on it, uh, but I am totally out of ammo, so might as well do that. Delighted to. Okay. Um, I don't have enough for the next one. A grenade launcher kills them in two shots or one, depending. Okay, I got you. 
You see later in the game, yeah. You keep hitting your hand instead of your face. Yeah, they're pretty uh pretty silly, those enemies, huh? Could upgrade the sniper rifle's power fully. I think I might do that too. Aha. All right, now I'm broke. Please come What's going again. on, Mother Miranda? How you doing? Welcome in. Um, hopefully I prove myself worthy. Uh, so it said, okay, to the right? Ah, yeah, okay. Didn't go, there's a room through here? Why was this unexplored? I don't understand. Why was this unexplored? I can craft a bunch of, I can probably craft some mines now, a decent amount. I got nine rusted scraps, so I can make six of those. Uh, how many? Hey, we got to get to the rule of three. Rule of three. Okay, I'll make some mines. I'll kind of make those as I go. Um, rusted scrap, I could make. I could use those. Or I could do the sniper rifle ammo. It only takes one rusted scrap. I don't know. <clears throat> You ought to show up masks and offer people hand sanitizer. <laughs> oh, this door was locked. Is that right, Covert? Hey, what's going on, Psychotic Persian? Lurky like I do? Appreciate that, my friend. Appreciate that. Um, Gunpowder? Uh, do we? Uh, I don't know. I think I kind of want to make some shotgun ammo. How much do I have now? Because I have none. Oh, I upgraded the gun, but I didn't get any ammo. So maybe that's maybe that's been patched really need this the only thing is I only have three shotgun ammo now uh, I don't really well, do I need to make six mines I don't even freaking know oh loud if it is patched that'd be a crime yeah I didn't get anything from it so are you gonna beat the game today I don't think I am I don't think so I think I've got one more but oh you need to upgrade ammo capacity gotcha okay I am close to the end yeah I know I know uh, the only thing is I don't have a ton more time today unfortunately um, well, so if I do this, I don't have enough to upgrade ammo capacity, unfortunately. All right, let's just put the ball right down there in the end. No, just kidding. We can't do that. Iron horse ball. Can't see. Oh, come on. Oh, okay. I guess that worked. Lame. There's a bit of a delay. Bit of a delay in the physics. Another one of these. Just pick up the ball and put it in the finish hole. I know. I would like to. I would. Trust me. I would like to. Let's see, how does it get stuck on that little lip there? I don't really understand. I don't really understand. Wait, really? You can go uphill like that? These last two puzzles have been a little tougher. I, that's the first time I dropped the ball on the last puzzle. Come on, how does it get stuck there? I don't understand. All right, let me try to rotate earlier this time. How'd that fall off there? Are you kidding me? What kind of garbage is this? What kind of garbage is this? Maybe I need to go this direction. I'm not sure what the best way to turn this thing is on this part. This part's actually pretty okay here. Uh, right there. Okay. You know let's let's see. Let's take a look at our where we're at here. This one is pretty hard. I can't imagine doing it on keyboard controls. Oh, really? I mean, I keep forgetting about that. It's not always done on keyboard. Let me try to go this way here. What is this? What can this do? I don't understand. How is that rolling backwards? 
kind of trash is this? I don't understand why it was rolling backwards there. It wasn't tilted. At least not that much. It rolled back really fast. Balls are really relaxing. Just suppose shooting monsters and then directing a ball through a dollhouse. That's that's a good point, actually. Miss that. Okay. How is it rolling out there? Small incline at the rolling pipes. Okay. All right. I think I somehow just woke up the computer with my voice. I don't really know how. These gears, some of them just move too slow. I think I, uh, I, I'm doing, it's too much, too many extremes here. I'm, I'm, I'm tilting it a little bit too hard each time. But also, this ball should not fall off the side. That doesn't make any sense. Okay, there we go. All right. So there's like a dead end here. There's no good way to see where this is at. On this side. Oh, great. No, 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 no. Come on. Come on. I'm tilting it so... <laughs> How heavy is this ball? How heavy is this ball? This thing must weigh like a thousand freaking pounds for it to not stop when you tilt it all the way backwards. Very heavy. It's iron. All right. Well, still, it's a thousand pounds. We've decided. It's a thousand pounds. Stop rolling, you piece of garbage. Oh, there, is there... Okay. Uh, I need to be able to see the train car. Gotta get this baby rolling nice and slow over here. Wait, where does this go to? Uh... Okay, there's a hole at the back of the thing? Oh, it's gonna... What the heck? I don't understand this part. There's not a lower track down there, right? Do I have to, like, fling my poop over that way? Oh. Okay, there's, like, a, a narrow track. Okay. I'm gonna have to fling it. Yeah. Middle beam, yeah. Need to roll on the track you were on. Tilt it? Yeah, I will. All right. Is there a way for it to fall off down here? I bet there is. Oh, maybe not. Well, that sucked. That really freaking sucked. We got the bister skull out of it. <laughs> 10 tons, I think that's about right there, uh, Fresh. I think it is. Yay! <laughs> that one sucked. That one, uh, that one was considerably harder than the rest, I feel like, but... All right, well, cool. Cool, glad we, glad we could do that. Glad we could do that. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Like I said, this one is, this one is one of the harder ones. Is there one even harder than that, you think? Oh, good. I was just thinking of ways to pass the time. How much does this one work? 30K? It's not even worth that much. I feel like, wasn't there another one worth more than that? Now to spend like kings. <laughs> upgrade the ammo capacity. I can't. I'm, oh my gosh. I'm seriously like 500 and, like 625 short. Come on, game? What is happening here? There was one worth 40K? That's what I thought. There was one worth a little more than that. Uh, maybe I should sell something else. Is anything worth? Nope, nothing's really worth much that I'd like to give away. You have extra explosive rounds, but those are actually pretty good. Yeah, I'm not selling anything. I'm not doing it. Do let me know Could sell the flashbangs, you think? I think I should. Wish I could. I kind of wish I could sell the knife at this point. 
knife isn't very helpful. Um, there's also this room back here, which I, I don't know if I'm actually going to be able to get anything from. Oh, not bad. Quick, quick path back there, Ethan. Not bad. Keep the flashbangs. Yeah, and that's what I'm thinking, too, because they're actually pretty decent for crowd control. They're pretty decent for that. Okay, this area has something for me. I don't know if it's a shiny or what. Something I missed over here. Could be in this uh, refuse pile over here. In this basura. The knife out. Slightly smaller so I can see a little bit more of my surroundings. This dude just loves jumping from, from high areas here. Oh, yeah, there's got to be some trash in here I didn't pick up, right? Probably some rusted scrap that blends right in. If it is, though, it'll be worth it. Need all the crafting materials I can get. Hmm. <laughs> oh, there it is. Got it. That didn't take too long. Probably one of those things I should have got the first time around. The whole area is rusted scrap. I know, right? It's, I should never run out. I should never run out now that I'm in this uh, this factory, right? Easy to miss on the first go. Hard to miss when hunting. True. Yeah, the first go, you're under a little bit more pressure. Once you get the area cleared, though. All right. Was there another room that I did not clear? Um, it might actually have gotten everything or no? Wait, hang on. Something down there? No. It might be it for right now until, yeah, this is the newer area. Okay. So go back up to B1, I guess. I think everything else is good, right? There aren't any uh, grayed out rooms. Oh, I haven't been in there. Is that going to be a problem? One moment. All right. Just collect the whole area and sell it. Boom profit. Exactly. Right? Why, why is this not a thing? I don't understand. All right. Yeah, I think that is actually everything. All right. Because I think this room here uh, that I was talking about, that one there, I think is connected elsewhere. Yeah, that's this, this area right here. MB3 and, and B3. Okay. So we got to go back up to B1 now. B1, baby. Um, I do have three med kits. I'm actually kind of hurt right now. I'm going to scrap gunpowder. Yeah, I'm going to make another shotgun ammo. I'm going to do it. to make sure all my guns are fully loaded here. Yeah. Uh, well, that one's not because I don't have enough ammo for it, but. All right. I'm going to use the Heisenberg key right in here. Uh, although there's still some stuff I missed. Potentially. Uh, huh. How do I get down there? Through here? Oh, okay. Well, now how do I get back up? Was there a ladder somewhere? <laughs> Whoops. Really think that one through. Some shotgun ammo, though. We'll gladly take that. And a mine. And another mine? Heck yes. Uh, so there's a zip line that's going to take me back. Oh, okay. Okay. We're good. Is it cleared now? It is. All right. Works out. Uh, do I have that hook at all times, or was that hook there already? I, I'm confused where that came from. I don't really know. So this area is not cleared. 
but now it is. Okay. Yeah, so that ended up being very worth... Very worth my time. Added Dimitres. The hook. Is it in my tools? I don't know. $25 for Black Widow or wait till October 6th? Wait. $25? Naturally. What happens in October 6th? Does it go into uh, Disney Plus? All right, this will give me enough to upgrade the ammo capacity on the uh, shotgun. I'm going to do that. Let's check that out. It did give me full ammo. Yes. Okay, good. Um, goes on Dis Oh, it goes on to Disney Plus for free. Gotcha. Okay. It's a premium purchase. That makes sense. Okay. Um, hmm. Hmm. Are you from October 6th? Okay, gotcha. Yeah, I don't know. I would, I mean, I'm probably going to wait. Personally. I'll probably wait. You really are a tough one. Small room here. But I'm tired of chit chat. Time to die. Oh, cool. Thanks, Eisenberg. You can hear it, can't you? Someone's waiting for you. Who could it be? Yes, please load up on all this ammo. That means I'm about to get my butt kicked. Wife bought Cruella the other week. Cruella? Blackwood is my fave Avenger. Oh, that's true. I knew that. I think I'm going to see if my wife wants to go to theater to watch it. The, the what now? Theater here has big seats that recline. Well, oh, those are nice. Prototype, Sturm. Use a cheap turboprop engine, but he's impossible to control. All he does is charge. Too much power output from the reactor? Completely invincible head-on. But the dumb butt managed to chop his own dang arms off on the propeller. Also issues with overheating from running for long periods of time. Conclusion, a complete failure. <laughs> okay, well, that's sad. That's really sad, Heisenberg. All in him a complete failure. Was I able to save it? Forgot to save it. <laughs> exactly. It's been too long since I've been in one. I don't remember the last time I was in one. Poor guy was trying his best. I know, right? Listen, it's not his fault that he's got a, like, propeller on the front. I don't have time for this bullshit. Out of my way. Oh, my gosh. I didn't even have a chance. So this dude's just going to... What is going on, my friends? Oh my gosh. <laughs> that dude turns around quick. And then I have no idea where I'm at as soon as I get hit by him. Okay. It's actually a pretty clever boss fight. Oh, he's on fire! Oh my gosh, are you serious? I thought he was just going to go up in flames himself, but I guess not. Can't see him through those walls either. What the heck, bro? How's he not getting stuck on stuff? Like he was before. Put this down. He wouldn't put the dang mine down. Like I died. Well. <sighs> but here in DC, most everyone is vaccinated. Yeah. Uh, what do you mean premium purchase on Disney Plus? You need to pay extra on top of the regular service. Yeah, it's like it's like pay per view. Yeah. See movies that are in theaters. Yeah, exactly. If it's a brand new movie, uh, that's what they do. He's an overcharge, so he's more powerful. Gotcha. 
uh maybe mows the mows the time for a flashbang now's the time for a flashbang i want to see all right we can do that although he doesn't have eyes so i don't know if it's going to help or hurt or do anything. Really are tough. Oh, dang it i have to go back through this room but i'm tired of chit chat time to die okay that's where i got the extra first aid kit i was wondering i totally forgot Someone. Lead him into the pipe so he gets stuck. Gotcha. Yeah, I was curious, or led him into the pipes. Yeah, I was curious what, um, why he was getting stuck sometimes and then other times just whipping right around. It's not pay per view, it's an unlock, so you can see it. Oh, okay, I didn't know that. I didn't know that. That's good. But it's, uh, similar, like the, the, the payment or the pricing, I guess, is similar to like a pay per view. You might have a service, but you still have to actually pay to unlock it. Although it's not, you know. I don't know, it, is, it is pretty weird to think about if, if you don't usually uh, if you don't usually buy like upgrades like that. I don't have time for this bullshit. I don't. I wait. Let me let this set this down, and then she's so freaking slow, though. We already got him on fire. I guess that's kind of okay. Is handgun ammo? He's gonna start coming through one of the walls at any point. I tried putting my arms up, but I guess it didn't work. Try and get him on this pipe over here. Come over here, you turd burglar. Ethan's just so freaking slow. He's just so slow. Okay, hang on. Let's try this. We're going to try this here. We'll try a flashbang. I don't know if the flashbang's going to work or not. I mean, it... I really needed that upgrade speed. Or speed upgrade, whatever you want to call it. Where the heck did he go? This guy sucks. <laughs> this guy sucks. Okay, he didn't get stuck on those pipes. I'm trapped. Somehow found myself in a dead end over here. Did he knock me through the wall? Okay. Let's try getting the grenade launcher back out. We're just going to use the uh, explosive. Oh, no, that's still a flashbang. Dang it. I need to equip this on my wheel. This is not doing... Uh, the, the knife is not doing me any good. Oh, this guy sucks. Is he dead? He's dead. Yeah. Woo. Oh my gosh. Sorry. Uh, price is a bit steep. Yeah, for sure. Black Widow, I knew when they put it up in MCU movie, I'd be the sucker. Premier access is that per movie or an add-on to your subscription? Per movie. Yeah, yeah. 
Price is supposed to be for families that would ordinarily, ordinarily spend more to theater. Exactly. They're just trying to get their cut. That's what it comes down to. Complex mechanical heart. <laughs> Let's go. That was super intense. Uh, that was a tough fight. I don't buy any of the D-plus movies, but that's the reason behind it. D-plus? Oh, Disney Plus. Okay. I was like, wait, is that your grade on the movie? Dang, that's harsh. <laughs> I read that as your grade for the movie. F, F minus. About 50, 150% of a movie ticket. Yeah, exactly. But again, it's, it's more for like $25. Say you had like six kids. You're not getting out of a movie without paying, you know, a lot more than $25. So that's why it's priced the way it is. I'm not saying I, I would do it cause I wouldn't, but, but there are some people it's a good value for. A cigar, huh? Uh, whose cigar is this? Cigar made in Cuba. It's really damp. Great. Glad I picked it up. Miranda's abominable. Her deceit knows no bound. You did it. <laughs> Our theater's doing a drive-in. 30 bucks per car for Black Widow. That's pretty expensive, too. This probably makes you realize why I suggested the rule three. Exactly, yeah. Oh, it's only $15 redos there for you, Covert? That's good. Merely a bunch of failed Cadu experiments to her. I was just lucky I had more affinity to the stuff than the poor other poor schmucks in the village. So she still calls me her son. What a joke. I'll never forgive her for what she did to me. That crazy bee has never been right in the head. She can't see a different it's a difference between experiment and family. Miranda just didn't didn't just change my body. She took my dignity. If I don't kill her, then my life will never be my own. Still, she may be crazy, but she's also powerful. She can turn anyone using the Megamycite. The trick is that brat Rose. If I could access her power, then maybe. Speaking of, the kid's dad, Ethan, has a pretty interesting body himself. Maybe I could get him to help me out. Uh, oh, yes. Ethan does have a very interesting body. Hmm? Very interesting. Them superior bounds. I just recently got Disney Plus. Want to see Loki? Yeah, of course. Time to use a VPN. Pounds, mate, pounds. No, dollar reduce. Everything is dollar reduce. I think this is actually going to be the plan. Save Black Widow for a dining out and theater visit on August 1st. Anniversary day. Very nice. Very nice. Covert is it pounds? It is pounds, not dollars. He is from the other side of the ocean. No, it's dollar reduce. It doesn't matter what the it does not matter what your your currency you think it is, it's just dollar reduce. Okay. Pounds, shekels, doubloons, dollars, euros, they're all dollar reduce. They're all the same. It's all the same. I didn't get anything, or I didn't get everything from this area over here. Ethan's body? Oh yeah. Similar, similar to uh, Jennifer's body. I actually never saw that movie. Anybody see that? Megan Fox. Literally a movie about her sex appeal. I never did see that. I'm kind of curious what it. Uh, <laughs> a little curious what it's uh, what it's like. But um, never saw it. Mm, okay. Was it something he had to knock the wall down for? Oh, he did. Oh, no, never mind. It's on the other side of this wall. Okay. Here we go. Another mine. All right. That's it. It's all the same to the merry, many faced God. Sounds like a good plan. That does sound like a good plan. So, your anniversary is at the beginning of August. Mine is at the end of August, August 30th. So, we bookend August. I've seen Jennifer's body. It's confusing with conversion between different dollar reduce, but it's non triggering to users of non American dollar reduce. Exactly. If I just call your currency dollar reduce, you can't even be upset at me. You know? It's like, oh, I can't even take this guy seriously. So I can't even be upset. I saw it and it's what you would expect bad. Megan Fox plays a vampire in there. In there? Yeah, yeah, a vampire. Mm-hmm. I didn't just... Uh, well, we'll see. Might have ruined something. I don't know. Find out. This looks like another good area for a fight. Even though I haven't even fully recovered from the last one. My anniversary is in the middle of August? Hey, what's going on, friends? Is it August 15th? <laughs> watch me. <laughs> watch me. Watch me force myself to get triggered anyway. So we got to celebrate in August, though I've got games to catch up on. Yeah, August. August is the month, I guess. 
Jennifer's Body is one of the best movies. Is that right? I uh, never seen it, so I, I couldn't say. But a bit like saying there are no more nationalities from now on. Everyone is Americanese. <laughs> oh gosh, Americanese. We are what our money is. Is that what you're saying, to Delicious? It's kind of shallow. Um, well, since I got everything from there, okay. Uh, but this room here, I guess it's not showing up. Is it one level up? I don't know why that didn't show up. Hmm. Oh well. Oh well. <sighs> That'd be cooler compared to your guys. 8, 19, I gotcha. I gotcha. I have to leave for now. It was fun watching. Thanks for hanging out, Extreme. Hope you have a good day. And a good weekend, my friend. Hey, what's going on, Dave? How you doing? Uh, it is a horror, but it's also a romance and a bit comedy. Is that right? Jennifer's body. Uh, romance, huh? I'm going to be honest. I wouldn't expect that. I not expect romance to be the right word. Um, oh, there's nothing to find in here. Okay. Allie Fox, appreciate that follow. Cheers, my new friend. Just saying the university cur currency being dollar reduced is a very American invention. Hmm. I actually heard it from an Australian guy, so it's an Australian invention. But they also call theirs, uh, they call theirs dollars, too, so. Uh, Canadians call theirs dollars, so it's not just American. I suppose you could call it North American, but Australia is not in North America, so. Even that's not even totally accurate, but. It's only watching while my daughter is a rage head recovering from RSV. Wait, what's RSV? Doing Pog? Glad to hear it. Uh, doing pretty Pog myself. Thanks for asking. Laser beam. Didn't feel horror in that movie, but it's kind of romantic for some people. It's more of a comedy or parody. Yeah, yeah, definitely got the parody vibe. What the? Oh, I am tripping balls right now. Oh, maybe I'm not. Just Magneto. Magneto is Not close. Bad. Not bad, Rogers. Your persistence. Okay, that's a pretty but cool I staircase. So stay out of my way. Oh come on. Wait, why why do I have that pistol all of a sudden? Oh what? Don't come! What the heck? Okay, he didn't just make himself into that, did he? Or did he? Is he controlling all the metal to make that? Or did he? Oh my gosh. So just the colonies then? Canadians call their loonies, so let's not involve them in the conversation. <laughs> loonies. That bastard. I thought he called him a fat bastard. It was that. Okay. I have some big boy important calls coming up, so I gotta run. Have a great Friday. Appreciate you hanging out with us today, Nander. Hopefully the big boy calls go well. And uh, have a great weekend, my friend. Uh, respiratory syntactical virus? I didn't say that right. Sink Sinkatol virus? She's old enough that it's not too serious. Can be lethal in infants. Oh, gosh. Okay. Well, I'm glad it's not too serious. Uh, Bella Dimitres, appreciate that follow. Cheers. Cheers. Welcome in. Metal Kinesis, yep. Mecha Nick Cage. Default weapon. Yeah, that was just so, so strange. I was like, did he make himself into that? Or is he just like mashing up all the metal together to make that abomination? Like, which one is it? Is he the abomination or... Okay. Oh. Like, waste runoff? Okay, there's nothing to explore in there. So we just got to go through here. Did he or did he? Heisenberg can control metal. Of course. Of course he can. He's Magneto. He is Magneto, after all. Anything to get in here? There is stuff to collect here in the scrap heap. Uh, fever, runny nose, sore throat, bad cough, ear infection, fun stuff. Hopefully it's going to be over soon, or at least it is. Oh, freaking Redfield. I told you to leave it alone, Ethan. What a dick butt. 
are in the way. What do you care, Chris? You killed my wife, you son of a bitch! You think I killed Mia? That wasn't her. It was Miranda. What? Uh, what? Come again? She's a bioweapon. She changed her appearance and pretended to be Mia. Seems she also survived being shot, so now I'm here to finish the job. Bullshit! Why don't you fucking tell me right away? Because I knew you would want to be involved. And this job is hard enough without civilians getting in the way. Why us, Chris? What the hell is going on? You're not the real Ethan. All right, Ethan. All right. I'm not the real Ethan, am I? I owe you an explanation. Just freaking, uh, uh, he's gonna tell Give me. Give me that wrench. Give me that wrench, and then he smacked me over the face with it. Gosh. Long story short, Miranda's fucking insane. In this village, all not these ignoring you all, but I am also not looking at chat because I don't want to. Just sort of in case, you know. Crazy experiment with the mold. The mold, like Louisiana. God damn it! All this time, I thought I could save my family. I can't escape from here. I can't do anything. I'm worthless. That might not be true. Take a look at this. What is this dude making over here? Got like an Iron Man? A few minutes ago. Miranda, keep looking. Rose. Rose. Holy shit, we gotta go. Relax, my men are monitoring the situation. But they have my daughter. You don't get anything. You don't stand a chance against Miranda by yourself. <sighs> I will stay down here and finish planting explosives. You take that elevator. Explosives. I'll meet you topside. I promise you, we will get your daughter back. Together. Damn straight we will. And when I find Miranda. She's a dead woman. He just right. smirks. Okay, kid. All right, kid. And you take this and do me a favor. Try to stay under the radar. Wow. Okay. So, did Ethan and Miranda get intimate? You'll know it soon enough. What's going on, Bella? Heisenberg is probably my favorite. Not going to lie, really? You ready for sparring practice soon? Is there anyone else I can ban for my mod day? <laughs> Fave part, I'm glad Chris's model got fixed in RE8. RE7, Chris looks so meh. Yeah. Ethan. I didn't see that, so yeah, just uh, definitely be careful, everybody. This is my first, very first playthrough. I, uh, I, I do not know what's going to happen. I've not watched somebody else play this part. The only parts of the game I watched people play were earlier on in the game. So, uh, so yeah. Chris's neck looks kind of odd in this, really? I have all the fun in the world. Heisenberg is definitely my favorite. Awesome. Miranda Ethan. Well, well, well. How turn the tables? How the, t <laughs> how the turntables? All right, let me see if I can explore this room more. Uh, Hound Wolf Squad. The sweep of the factory is complete. No proof of any connection with the organization. Guess this just wasn't our lucky day. I did manage to get my hands on a number of documents disclosing some of Miranda's experiments, which support our previous theories. She seems to have infected herself with the mutamocyte, uh, which has granted her a number of abilities, including mimicry. She can control her cells and transform herself to look like anyone or anything. She disguised herself as Mia and infiltrated the Winters' home. Winters'. Her objective was clearly to kidnap Rose. Maybe she thought she could control Rose easier if she looked like her mom. When we attacked, it put a little damper on our plans, so she mimicked a corpse. She then revived herself in the transport truck, killed everyone on board, and took off with Rose. Things didn't go the way she had originally planned, but in the end, she still got what she wanted. Until now. It's time to rendezvous and blow this place sky high. This might turn into a fight with Heisenberg, but I think I found something useful. He's left one of his little toys laying around, and it's even made from a metal-slash-polymer co composite, which he can't control. Time to turn the tables. Alpha. Uh, as in the thing I just killed? I 
I believe Miranda gave birth or Mia gave birth to Rose and Miranda switched out with her somewhat recently. Yeah, that's what it seems like. That's what it seemed like. I when I was talking about intercourse, I was just saying like, did Mia and Ethan get intimate like at some point after Miranda took over? That would be uh, pretty convincing, huh? That would make it extra convincing that it's Mia. All right, a couple other things in here. If Chris is to be believed, true, true. That dude wasn't telling me jack, jack crap until now, so who knows? All right. Given the opening scene, I'm sure they did. Of course they did, right? Oh yes, and he's not even upset about it. He's like, I just want to find Rose. I know that I put my wiener in some mold. I don't care anymore. Would have done it with the other one too, but she didn't make it out of Resident Evil 7. So. Um, unfortunately, my friends, I think Curry was correct. And uh, we're going to have to wait till uh, next week to see the conclusion of this game. Uh, potentially next week. So we'll see. Uh, maybe even maybe even further, but <laughs> wiener and mold, yeah. Well, I mean, if Miranda is infected with the mold, then Ethan put his wiener in the mold. Oh, you think it's going to be two more sessions? Dang. <laughs> you can't leave yet? I'm sorry, Dave. I got to get to work. I got something uh, I got something I've been working on for a long time at work. I got to get wrapped up today. So uh, I apologize, my friends. I would like to be able to finish this, but I, I do have to work today. Uh, let's have a sip in the tavern. Not the wiener in the mold. <laughs> I mean, I just... Poor Ethan, right? See ya, Ams. Thanks for hanging out with us today. Uh, let me do these creditos real quick. And, uh... I got a couple extra thank yous to give that I don't think are going to show up here, but I will do so if I can, uh... If I can anyway. Uh, we got some cheers from Dr. D, Majestic Marla, and Nidalicious. We had Coleman, uh, <laughs> Chaotic, Just Query, Curry... Uh, Loose bot as well as Nidalicious on the one day mod duty. Oh, we got follows from Bella Dimitres five six seven Ali Fox Games one Nikito Imitator, uh, and I'm not no no I'm not doing this. Subs from Doctor D eleven six Curry Cosmos. We also got um, converted subs from True Kelt as well as Ams zero six zero six zero. So thank you everybody for hanging out with me today. I've really been enjoying uh, the the good old uh, Freaky Fridays. So. Uh, and I, I guess we're going to be continuing it for a little while longer. And again, I'm not upset about it. So have a good day. You as well, Bella. Thanks for the stream. Have a great weekend. You as well, potatoes. Have a great day at work. I'll do my best. I'll do my best. I've got something, like I said, something I've been working on. Uh, they got to hopefully wrap up today. So uh, thanks for the stream. Lose the good guild combo and screw the insta ban from Nidalicious. Of course, of course. Um, the good news is, um, well, No longer is a moderator anymore, so that's on loots. I warned you. <laughs> there you go. Nidalicious is no longer a moderator. Uh, my friends, thank you so much for being here today. I hope you all have an amazing rest of your Friday and an amazing weekend. Uh, I had to do it before I forgot, you know, Nidalicious, while I was thinking about it. So um, anyway, <laughs> I hope you guys have an amazing rest of the day, uh, amazing weekend. We'll be back again on Monday. Um, uh, and, uh, the new schedule or maybe not. Well, I guess it's not going to be that new. It's going to be pretty much the same schedule as, uh, this past week till we finish up Resident Evil Village. So, um, my friends, thank you so much for hanging out with me today. Hope you have an amazing day. I will catch you next week until then. Please take care. Be safe. Enjoy your weekend. And I will see you on Monday. Bye.